The assets we are going to use are the Low Poly Sci-Fi Building Pack and Low Poly City Park. You can find these assets on the Unity Assets Store. The assets are very well optimized only using one or two texture maps. The assets are also nicely optimized for baking light which we will be doing later on. If you would like to try these assets or something similar check out the link in the description. Laying down the modular roads. I started off by creating the western style square city blocks. I grabbed the road prefabs that came with the package and started placing them in my scene. I took the roads I placed in the scene and put them in an empty game object so I can quickly create more roads as you can see in the video example. Building the city. The low poly sci-fi assets come with a nice variety of stylized buildings. I started placing them in the scene. It was interesting to see how this slowly came together as I started placing them. The goal was to create a few sections of buildings and then put them in an empty game object to be duplicated. After that I moved a few buildings around on each block so everything doesn't seem repetitive. The fog and skybox. Be sure to step back and take a look to make sure everything is coming together nicely. Next I wanted to get a skybox for the scene. I got the skybox from the Unity Assets Store. The link to them is in the description. Now let's add a bit of fog. I went to the lighting tap and went to environment. From there I scrolled down to the fog settings and used a dark blue colored fog. The reason I chose this color is because it's the same color as the sky. This will give your scene some depth. Setting up post-processing. Now let's go over the lighting. For this scene I used the standard directional light for the main lighting. The directional light is set to mix. I want to bake the lighting of a few of the assets to see how it will turn out. Next I wanted to add some spotlighting to simulate street lighting. We are going to set those to mix as well. I needed to adjust the color grading really fast. In post processing I turned on color grading and set the color mode to aces to get a bit more contrast. I played around with the trackballs to get even more contrast and brightness.
baking light. Now it's time to bake the lighting. I went to my lighting tab and then to the scene. Then I turned on global illumination. Now scroll down to the light mapping settings and set the lighting mode to shadow mask. Then I set my light map resolution to about 40 and my light map size to 512. Be sure to turn on ambient occlusion. This could take up to one to two hours to bake depending on your computer setup. After baking I didn't notice too much of a difference between post-processing ambient occlusion and baking. Baking is not really needed for this scene. Post-processing alone seems to be the best choice. Thanks for watching our tutorial on stylized sci-fi environments. If you like what we do, you can support us on Patreon. You can also support us by liking and subscribing to our channel for the YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to leave a comment below. This will help us make more Unity 3D content.